In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the best prospecting software ever, Clay. I'm going to go over what you can do with Clay and how to go from no account to actually installing the best prospecting machine you have ever seen. I will show you how to get information that your prospect didn't even knew he put out online and you can leverage your advantage. And actually, how to use automation and AI to actually scrape prospect problem at scale and create a fully automated sales machine for your organization. So first of all, what is exactly clay.com and why it's totally revolutionary for everybody who wants to start their own lead generation agency? Clay is a sales operation engine, meaning that it can create amazing sales lists and actually get data from all over the web to actually be relevant and create personalized outreach totally at scale. Let's start with a very, very simple account setup. As you can see, Clay is organized in table, folder, and workbook. What you can basically do is you can create amazing folders to actually contain your table or you can actually create a table. With a table actually it's very easy. There are many ways to create a table but to keep it simple if you create like a company table you will get into those uh, sort of spreadsheet with a lot of API connected where you can basically manipulate the data and create amazing prospecting and sales lists. You can see that you have actions and you have other enrichment. Enrichment is the place uh, where you basically have all the scrapers, all the APIs. For example, you want to connect smart lead, send emails, so you have smart lead. You want to get uh, commerce uh, data, you have a connection to store leads. You want to get uh, news, uh, you can probably have Google News too. You want to create a Google search, you can create a Google search. You want uh, financial data, you can probably use Crunchbase. You you can basically bring data from all over the web and use them at your advantage to create better prospecting. Apart from enrichment, you have other things like import, you can import data from to your table, export, you can export all your data. And this is very amazing because you can share in public your template. Like I built an amazing template for e-commerce, I want to share it to my coaching clients. I just share the template and you can copy and paste this to another Clay account. Here are on uh, the really top of uh, the clay table, you have your credits, you have your account and uh, other very simple features. And apart from this, uh, you have uh, some other features here like rename, you can rename the table, you can convert to a custom table, you can duplicate the table, view the graph mode or enable auto dedupe. Auto dedupe is when you have, for example, people from the same company, you dedupe the list, you get only one company per list. So as you can see from enrichment, formulas, to actions, they dupe and other things, you can really manipulate a sales list at 360 degrees. The next step is to how to build a lead list and this is the most important part probably at all, even better than creating a good offer or uh, creating very good AI personalization. So how can you create uh, a very very good table? Create new, you can see there are table but from people there are a lot of tables and the first step which should be mapping the total addressable market is very important because uh, a very good list will dramatically increase uh, the success of your prospecting and uh, really rise uh, the high response of your campaigns. At first, it can seem a little bit intimidating, but with experience and some logical reasoning, you will find a way very, very fast. For example, are you prospecting into agencies? So where are agencies listed, more or less? Well, from a logical standpoint, they are listed on LinkedIn because every agency wants to be on LinkedIn and there's a very high incentive for the founder to be listed there. And if you start from fine companies or fine people, you can really put filter like agents to actually create a very good list of companies, in this case of agencies. On the other hand, for example, let's say you want to prospect to gyms or restaurants. Both are local businesses. They had zero incentives to be on LinkedIn, but for sure they would be on Google Maps. They would be on Google Maps because it is the main source where all the tourists or the people in a place will check to find these places. So to find the restaurant
runs an amazing data source. Let's make an example with companies. You can click on find companies. You can filter by industry. In this case, could be advertising. You can filter for the number of employees. You can filter for private, public, partnership, etc. You can include and exclude description. Could be like agency, marketing team, location United States, and we can preview company okay import import to new table and in this way continue for free without spending a dime on credits i would have my amazing lead list of all companies as you can see i really have a lot of data from the size type country domain linkedin url and three the basis to start our prospecting campaign on the other hand if i want to find local businesses i can do the same create new table in this case i would start from maps i I can use a location query like uh, New York. I can find a kind of business, uh, for example, a gym. Number of results, uh, let's cap it to 50. This new blend table and Clay will do his magic and find uh, all the gyms. Uh, okay, let's see now how to reach leads uh, starting from uh, series of people or companies. Create a new table. In this case, we can even start from uh, find people job title we can put owner or we can put manually the c or the location we can put the United States. Let's cut to 500. Preview people. Of course, there are a lot from different companies. We import, continue for free. Okay, we have a lot of people. And of course, we want to go on with the enrichment because we want to call, call those CEOs. We want to call the email to CEOs and maybe use some LinkedIn automation. So what is the best way to do this song clay? For example, if you want to find the email to actually send cold emails is what is called the email waterfall as you can see you have a waterfall of providers so you maximize the possibility to actually getting a valid email and i think here really comes the problem of scaling without credits again on clay we have credits and with credits we can basically use any kind of provider but if you start using clay you will soon realize that credits are just too expensive right now but instead of credits we can actually buy the single APIs and there's a list of APIs I typically use that can really scale with just four APIs 90-90% of clay list so instead of using credits I just put using your own API you can change by clicking on the engine configure API key so instead of using the clay one you can use your own you just have to go to the website in this case of lead magic sign up get the API key put it here as an input I have to put the full name and the company domain because of course find an email address you need a combination of full name name surname and company domain save save around 10 rows and as you can see you can totally find all the email addresses using a cascade of different providers starting from lead magic which is the first and if lead magic is not successful the other one that follows and you get the email address that you can later send to your own provider like smart lead to actually outreach at scale all these contacts and exactly the same way i can actually find even phone numbers so let's say you have a team of cold callers too why just prospect ceos who are such high level decision makers where you can even contact them through cold calls and you can even bring more meetings exactly in the same way by the fact that clay is just an aggregator of different data provider you can find phone numbers numbers maybe starting with again the one that you have your own api to save some credits and this time what you really need as an input is the linkedin profile save run the rows and by the way these are not company numbers these are real phone private numbers the one from your smartphone basically so the pickup rate would be amazing and the conversion would be amazing if you have a decent script okay now we have uh, our well-designed lead list uh, we have uh, reached the contacts we have the email and it's it's time to apply some AI personalization to be relevant at scale. So what we can do is, uh, first of all, we have to think about the copy and what kind of personalization we want to do. So let's say that on smartphone.
smart lead I want to create a personalized cold email campaigns that says something like a hey, first name I noticed you are running company name so first of all there are levels of personalization we will start with very basic personalization like first name company name last name or any other variable we can easily find on LinkedIn personalization really depends on what you're selling with your ICP and for the sake of this example let's say I'm a legion agency I want to sell my outbound services so I'm using outbound to sell my outbound services so I'm reaching out to other companies saying hey do you want me to book leads for you so on a very basic level you can just use a first name I noticed that you are running company name since we are prospecting the CEOs we can do this very easily since we probably already have first name just from the very simple people import from clay and we even have company name so what we can do is out enrichment I'm using smart ad lead to campaign you have to put your own API you have to create a campaign first and you can look here at the name of the campaign in this case b2b lead gen test now in the input the email address that we previously found first name and in our case company name save run the rows i can run all over the rows so you can really see that i can do this at scale and when i go back to smart lead as you can see instead of writing this in plain text i have the variable first name i notice you are running company name and when you see the preview you will see that a first i notice you are running company name but this is just only the first level of personalization let's say i want to go even deeper a first name i noticed you are selling to ICP. So I can with AI and uh, Clay Agent find at scale what is the ICP of your target prospect and quote it in the body of the email to totally impress your prospect. How can we do this? Easy. We can find the Clay Agent. Again, you can choose to run by credits uh, or even better, plug your own API not to consume too many credits. You can say something like visit company domain and find what is its ICP. I ideal customer profile who's selling to just return three words save run 10 rows and the clay agent would go inside each company domain and we'll find at scale with very very high accuracy what are these companies what are these CEOs selling to you see someone sell to robot manufacturer someone sell to ask professional and another interesting example is uh, find people at company from Apollo we can even quote people internal to the organization like marketing sales Sales company domain is this or business or revenue. This Apollo integration will find all the prospects, uh, all the job titles that are working in those companies. So when I reach out to the CEO, I can say, Hey, CEO, I notice you're selling to manufacturers. Is your employee responsible of generating revenue? Is, uh, in this case, uh, your business development director responsible to actually generate leads? Maybe Maybe he can find useful this template and my unique process to help business development director to book more pipeline. It's enough to reopen the integration, go on edit column and add all the other personalized fields. If you don't find your field, you can add a custom field so you can plug the name of the other decision maker. You can plug the ideal customer profile that you find before and you can really create a totally personalized email at scale with a level of relevance that you have never seen before. Do you remember when I told you that with Clay you can actually start your own Clay agency? Well, this video is made on purpose to actually start your own Clay agency. Why is better than a lead generation agency and why is probably the best opportunity in 2024 to actually start a new business. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.